Hi there, it's Holly Chandler of the Julie Kinnear team, taking you on a tour of the second floor apartment of 283 Evelyn Avenue. It's a mirror image of the third floor apartment. Check out our website, lovelytorontohomes.com for the floor plans and more details about the neighborhood, about the house itself. And these are large windows, like a third floor apartment, like all houses that are mid-century modern will have. The open concept living room, dining room, very large spaces, and the kitchen, the Eden kitchen. Yeah, look. And there's a door separating it. There is a rather long hallway. Oh, there's a closet. Oh, there's a closet at the front. Closet at the front, linen closet. There's a view of the hallway. So it's really um, well separated, the private and public space kind of thing. So um, there is a door that separates that main space from the bedroom. So it's 1,400 square feet. It's kind of like having your own wing, separate wing for the bedrooms. That's the uh, side entrance and the laundry room is down there. So this is the first bedroom. So again, large windows and closet. All the bedrooms have closets. There's the closet behind there. And up here, forward, have the bathroom. So it's a large bathroom and cool tile, like the third floor apartment and retro tubs, tubs around um, and uh, cast iron tub. <laughs> Oh, I'm running into walls. Um, here we go into the second bedroom. It has a closet behind that door as well. Then third floor bedroom. Sorry, the third third bedroom, primary bedroom. I'm going to take you through the third floor apartment of 283 Evelyn Avenue. It's a 1,400 square feet foot uh, three bedroom apartment, which is a rarity um, in the city. Lots of storage. Uh, and very functional space. So, which is common to um, mid-century modern design. So it was built in 1958. And let me show you this uh, large window. So you can tell it's a beautiful street just by the homes here. Large homes, we've got a modern build. Um, just around the corner, you can see it. So uh, it's a very established street. It's wonderful for, um, for families. It's in a great school catchment area, and it's just steps away from all the restaurants of the junction. So with mid-century design, one of the details uh, is the functionality of the rooms. So we have an open concept living room and dining room, and then there's a, an Eden kitchen. And we've got hardwood floors, which are in great shape. So large, large kitchen. And um, these cupboards are, uh, are original to the house, but they're in great condition. So they never thought to, uh, to change them. There's no need. Um, I've got, so this is the hallway. So it's a longer hallway, but what I like about it is that it separates the sort of public space from the private space. So from all the bedrooms. And, um, you know, if you've got somebody having a nap in the back, um, they're not disturbed by somebody watching television. This is the side entrance. So being a purpose-built uh, triplex, there are two separate entrances. So one to the side and one through the front. So again, windows everywhere. And the bathroom, I'll show you the bathroom after. This is one of the bedrooms. So large windows and a closet. So every room has a closet. And take you into the bathroom. Now the bathroom is quite special. You gotta see this tile. The tile is, is amazing. It's very uh, trendy right now to have older style tiles. So, and these are in great shape. And it's classic, sort of 1950s, 60s, uh, pink tile with black trim. 
And the green bathtub there is, um, it's cast iron. And so super cool, large bathroom. And the second floor apartment is pretty much a carbon copy of this, even the bathrooms, except it has a pink tub. So we go into the second bedroom and again, great windows. The windows are about 10 years old and this boiler heat, which is um, quite quiet. It's a new boiler, it's just one year old. One year old. And um, here's the primary bedroom. It overlooks the garden. There are two closets and it faces, faces east. So you get lots of natural light. So 1,400 square feet and three bedrooms, one bath, open concept spaces, functional layout, and uh, large windows. Plus there's, there's a dedicated um, laundry space downstairs as well. They have their own machine. Uh, so there you go, uh, third floor apartment of 283 Evelyn Avenue. Check out our website, lovelytorontohomes.com for floor plans, more pictures, more details about the neighborhood and property. Thanks for watching.